Welcome back to another non-spoiler movie review of Christmas month, you know. Um, is this the week of Christmas? I think it is. Um, so yeah, expect a Christmas uh, special on Christmas at 5 o'clock. Um, so, first thing... If you've watched the video from not last week, but the week before last, uh, then uh, skip three minutes. But hey, Tim Tim has something to say. Thank you, Tim Tim. Um, so if you've been following this channel for a while now, then you'll know that I wrote a book. It's on the video called I Wrote a Book. Uh, it has pictures of BNBA on it. And also if you've been following my websites and stuff, my Instagram I think has some of it. My Twitter has a lot of it. Um and it was only on Google Docs at that moment. Um and if you didn't read it there because oh it's Google Docs, it's not the best place to read a thing. Um well now I have a very special announcement for Christmas and no the sequel is not out yet I'm working on it give me a minute it takes a while this one this one took me um I started it inside like February of this year and then I like forgot about it for like five months and then I continued it so it actually took me about like I don't know a week or two to write but it 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 actually took like six months to start real time. Um, because I forgot about it for like, actually it's not five, but it's four. Who cares? Uh, but now, it's not only on Google Docs. Now I'm going to add a PDF form. Uh, and the very special announcement. It is on actual sites. Actual, actual ones. It's on 24 symbols, scribed. Uh, Tolino Viblio. I've not heard of these four ever, um, but I've actually checked them out. Some of them are subscriptions. Uh, I wouldn't recommend to just get the subscription only for BNBA because it is free elsewhere. Uh, BNBA is free and will probably always be free unless if something major happens. Uh, it's also going to be on Rakuten Kobo. I haven't heard any new information, but I submitted it into like October and it's still not out on Rakuten Kobo. By the way, this has been happening for a few months now and it finally went on to um, stuff. And the two most important ones is it is on Apple Books, officially on Apple Books, and it's on Barnes & Noble Nook. So you can go read it for free on Apple Books and Barnes & Noble Nook and the other things that I said. It's fine. Uh, go read it. And now to the video. Well, like he said, on with the video. So, me and my mother watched a series on Netflix called The Christmas Prince. Um, and it's a really good uh, movie series. Uh, we watched the first one, uh, and it's about this reporter girl from New York, and then she w goes over to this fake country and meets this prince and stuff. And it's, you know, generic Christmas uh, movie romance. Um, but it's good, and it has a, and they have like a queen with a genetic disorder. I forgot which one it was, but it was, I actually heard of it before, um, it's out of one of my classes. Um, and like, it, it's really good, it's a really cute movie series. Um, but yeah, it's about, it's about this reporter, uh, goes over to this place called Aldonia. Uh, to actually get, like, a bunch of cool, um, like, 
what's the word? Juicy stuff. Uh, like, um, sorry, that was my computer. It's dealing with stuff. Uh, so that's why I have my finger up here is because it's on, my phone's on my computer. Um, so, and then they have a, like, a sequel to that movie with, like, more characters and more love interest for the minor characters, and it's a good, it's a good one. And then they have a third one, and it was, uh, it was, it was probably, the third one's probably the worst one, to be honest. Um... But The Christmas Prince, I, I really hope that there's a four, a fourth one that comes out. It's probably not going to come out this year, but maybe next year. Uh, just because I, I am really attached to the story of The Christmas Prince. Uh, I really want to know what happens to her. Uh, I forgot her name. I want to say Emma or Anna or something. I don't know, but it's, it's a good movie. Anyway, yeah, this has been a non-spoiler review. The, um, uh, the first one, probably like a 7 out of 10. The second one's probably like a, uh, probably about a 7 out of 10. The third one's probably a 6 out of 10. Um, so yeah, if you haven't yet, go watch all three of those movies. Uh, not back-to-back, -back because they are a lot of just corny romance. And... I love it. So, yeah, go watch it. It's, on, it's a Netflix exclusive. All right, bye.